Namaste, hola. I am currently in Costa Rica, about to film some yoga videos on the beach for you guys, but I wanted to make a quick video on something that I've personally used for a few years. It's basically a switch in mindset that quickly empowers you. So I'll start with a quote I heard that's similar to this mindset, and it goes, I used to walk into a room and wonder if people would like me. Now I walk into a room and wonder if I'll like them. First time I heard this quote was a few years ago and it really resonated with me at the time because at that point in my life I was really going through a transition and starting to look at the people in my life wondering if I still wanted them in my life and I was also starting to care less and less what others thought of me. When you walk into a room, what's your thought process? Are you anxious if people will like you? Are you worried you might do something wrong? So instead of having those low vibrational thoughts, flip it around and take your personal power back. Will I like them? What do they have to offer me? And you can use this in a lot of different circumstances. Another example is when you're going on a date with someone new for the first time. You might be worried, oh, will this person like me? Will they think I'm funny? Will I be good looking enough? Will I be charming? Ask yourself instead, will I like him or her? Will they be funny enough for me? What do they have to offer that can better my life? And this doesn't have to be so much that you come off cocky, just enough to get rid of these negative vibrations and exude confidence and self-love. You can also use this before an interview. Instead of worrying if they'll think you're smart or educated enough, ask yourself, do they deserve my time and expertise? I was recently watching an interview with Brené Brown on Oprah, and they were talking about sharing your shame story. I don't know if I necessarily agree with shame. Basically, it's your personal story that you could be embarrassed to share with others. Instead of feeling like a burden by sharing your story with someone else, she says to ask yourself, do they deserve to hear my story? And this can be so powerful. I can openly share my story, but I don't have to share it with anyone who will listen. You have to earn the right to hear my story. So this can take a lot of practice, but with time you'll be able to get it. And at first it could be easier to just stop yourself when you catch yourself in those thoughts and replace it with a simple affirmation, such as, I am worthy, I am beautiful, and keep repeating it until you believe it. I know it might sound a little simple, but it really does work. Hope that helps. I have some yoga to go do. If you have any questions, just comment below. Namaste.